Hi guys, I'm going to try a new way to uh, plug up these bottles for doing bottle explosions in microwaves. Previously I've just uh, either super glued a metal piece in or blobbed a bunch of silicone in the, in the top. But neither of those, it's hard to find the metal piece that fits in right and the silicone just doesn't seem to hold. So this time what I'm going to do is try to fill the top stem of the bottle up with um, fiberglass resin. So what I'm planning to do is put a sliver, a small piece of uh, cork, down into the bottom at about this level, then fill the top up with resin. Okay, the cork is in there now. And now the next thing we have to do is clean out the inside, this thing with alcohol. Clean it out. Okay, the resin is mixed. Let's pour that in. There we go. Let's wait for this to dry overnight and put it and put it in the microwave tomorrow. Oh, that was powerful. A lot more powerful than I expected. The oven is completely shredded. There's nothing is left intact. The lid just got flat. <laughs> the oven cavity, which was a U shape, is almost a bowl now. What's the flat? Sorry, now. <laughs> torn, torn to shreds. The electronics bay is completely destroyed. All the blades have been blown off the fan. <laughs> Notice it's shorted out here. <laughs> you can see there's spark. <laughs> and of course there's a huge mess everywhere. Looking up, I notice a nice little hole in the light fixture there. And also, debris, objects are embedded in the insulation up here. <laughs> and lots of objects in the garage door too, like this one. And it looks like my attempt to tie down the top clamps did not work because the clamp bar just came out of these things. You're about to see the most spectacular video I've ever taken on this high-speed camera. Let's have a look. been a successful couple of days, We've gotten two microwaves prepared for recycling, I guess you could call it. Anyway, thanks for watching.